Preparation and Administration of Oral Rehydration Solution or RSL. This product is used to replace fluids and minerals such as sodium, potassium, lust. It helps prevent or treat the loss of too much body water dehydration. The purpose is to treat dehydration, to help relieve diarrhea without losing too much fluid, and to help fluid retention when vomiting. Indication, prevention and treatment of dehydration fluid loss. For the client education, educate patients the importance of water retention and when they should take the oral rehydration solution to teach patients on how to make a homemade rehydrating solution and to teach them the proper usage of the solution so, the, so there are no cases of overusing. And for the special considerations, people with allergic reaction that are specifically sensitive to the solutions or patients contraindicated to such and the equipments are the aerosol sachet, distilled water, rock salt, sugar, knife, teaspoons, pitcher, and glass. Assess the extent of the client's dehydration to know the proper dosage according to the patient's conditions. Weigh the client so you'll know how much dosage of the oral solution is adequate for the patient's body. Wash hands to observe sanitation. In preparing for the aerosol solution, you can produce a homemade oral rehydration solution by pour 1 liter of sterilized distilled water, 5 glasses, to the clean container, take a teaspoon of rock salt, leveled by knife or flat object, add the salt in the water, take 8 teaspoon of sugar leveled by a knife of any flat object, add sugar into the water, and stir the mixture. Next is to taste the mixture. If it is saltier than tears, discard the solution and prepare another mixture using same process. And you can also make a mixture of 1 glass to 100 ml by adding 1 pinch of salt and 2 teaspoons of sugar only to add more if needed. Next is to administer or teach the mother to give the solution to the patient. For mild dehydration characterized by thirst, dry mouth, less urine, weight loss, give 50 ml aerosol per kilogram body weight in 4 to 6 hours. For moderate dehydration, characterized by sunken fontanel for babies less than 1 year old, rapid deep breathing, loss of skin elasticity, give 75 ml aerosol per kilogram body weight in 4 to 6 hours. For severe dehydration, characterized by weak pulse, cyanosis, cold lungs, and or coma. Give 100 ml aerosol per kilogram body weight in 4 to 6 hours except for coma. To identify the cases in which the patient is under and this helps calculate how much solution the patient needs depending on the case. Next is to assess the patient's hydration status every 4 hours. Next is if the patient needs to go to the hospital, give him oral fluids on the way if he is conscious. Lastly is to use the prepared solution within 24 hours only. Discard the remaining solution after 24 hours. The solution isn't safe to use after 24 hours.